Good morning. It's Monday. And this morning I've got the new guy coming in around 10 and we are gonna I'm gonna go show him the sights. So he knows what he's doing. He'll be operating our equipment. Then hook up the plows and make sure we have fuel and everything and because we got a storm coming in. All right, because yeah, they said that we've got a storm coming in, six to eight inches. Now um, it's supposed to start tonight, around midnight, but the heaviest part is going to be Tuesday morning. So that's the plan for today, and we're back to a regular vlog. Hook up all the equipment and get fuel filled up in the all the bobcats. And I've got so much mail. Look at all this mail. So I'm gonna head out. All right, let's hook up the plow here. Get everything all ready. So let's fill up the bobcat. Up and it was oh, okay. I don't, I don't have no <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, that's good for you, man. Yeah, that's pretty much been every time I came with them, and otherwise, I'm at work. I'm trying to hook up this hose and it's giving me trouble. switched over from the um, S570 to this one just because like I said we use more of the snow bucket than the fast hatch so and the other one the 5S5 no 
Yeah, the S570 is a two-speed, so it goes faster than this one. We got two Bobcats, one snow bucket, and a fast hat. So got one guy, one guy ready for the snow removal. Alright, so I'm taking the Ford, the Explorer up to my brothers and we're gonna actually change the alternator. Jeez, look at that. Uh, yeah, we got a flat tire so we gotta pump this up, look at that. Yeah. First I gotta hook up the, actually hook up um, the battery because we disconnected the battery in this thing. It's, uh, door handle's broken right there. But it's a good running vehicle. You know? it's, uh, okay. Let's see if it starts. So the only reason why it starts is because we put in a new battery. So I just gotta get it up there to my brothers before the battery drains. But right now we're gonna pump up the tires. Let's head up to my brothers. All right, so the battery is really low and I've got to dry. Look, you can see the battery gauge. It's really low. Luckily, it's still a little bit light out. I'm driving without the lights on right now, but uh, heading up to my brothers. Hopefully I can make it up there before the battery dies. All right, so we spent like 15 minutes trying to, the door locked on itself, but with the key and the ignition and everything, uh, but we got into it. 
with, yeah, luckily my brother had some tools here to get into it. So now we're going to put on the alternator. I'm going to probably cancel that. Open that up. The turn right there. I wonder what size that 13. Is it the same? This is a 2001. Yeah. 2001 Ford Explorer. Exploder. Exploder. <laughs> Ford Exploder. Alright, so that's out. 15 minutes. That's all it took. It took, long, it took longer to get us in the... Or, or the... At O'Reilly's is 160. 120. You got it for 70 bucks. Off of what? eBay? eBay. Brand spanking new. Can't believe you can willing to wait. If you're willing to wait just a little bit, it's better to get all these parts offline versus <coughs> just ordering it or getting it at a car parts store. They they rob you. All right. So what I'm gonna do? We gotta replace that door handle. I'm gonna YouTube it here quick too. Oh, YouTube while he's fixing. Damn. The door handle looks worse. Yeah. yeah, we're good down there. Yeah, it's going up. Get some fresh gas in there. Get that gas. Yeah. Oh, gotta get it